for speaking as much as for writing the cliche phrases are not even 50 i would say 70 percent of your success because they save you a lot of time you learn them beforehand so you're able to reel it off whenever you need it and use the same phrases same words please don't try to be creative every time you only usually have five to ten minutes for every speaking task believe me you'll be stressed out you'll have to put some sense in what you're saying you will not have time to think about all the sophisticated phrases that you've used once and then twice you have to really be automatic with them confidence is key speak confidently freely nicely quite loud but not too loud to try not to look at, at your notes too often because examinators they actually assess your ability to speak fluently to speak confidently and freely even if you're making small grammar mistakes please don't stress that much uh, the most important is that the examinators they understand you your point and you're saying uh, important things so you're seeing the substance um, but also linking all the sentences uh, with each other using this uh, nice phrases that you've learned months before and wrapping it up with uh, introduction and conclusion you've also um, aced uh, many many weeks before the actual exam and the last thing here time is the most important since speaking is usually uh, limited in five to ten minutes please before the exam make sure to count sentences how many sentences you are able to produce during the actual exam during this five minutes so think okay two sentences the introduction two sentences conclusion and then all these connections basically you have to count uh, yourself because some people are slow speakers some speakers are fast you then need to customize the amount of sentences you'll be saying but to reduce this human factor the stress factor you have to know 70 percent of what you're saying saying uh, at the speaking part even before it starts and these are all this conclusion introduction lincoln words and so on i really hope that this amazing whiteboard was useful for you and all my inside thoughts and insights knowledge on this topic was helpful for you if so please you know what to do <laughs> and uh, if you still have any questions or want to consult with me uh whether you're doing um the right thing in preparing for a uh, go to exam you're going through right now i was here to help at um my email juiceland at gmail.com i will see you in my next video and i wish you the productive fall see you <laughs>